Watch you guys got another video here for you in this one we're taking a look at windows 10 keeps crashing when you're trying to print an item on your pc now if you've just updated your operating system after patch tuesday then you're going to have an issue uh, printing and this is because of a couple of files which is the kb 5802 and also kb 5808 these two files are causing major problems uh, with printers and causing a blue screen of death which will basically uh, be like what you're seeing on the screen right now now as of this time microsoft have pulled those uh, updated files from the update system and uh, they will probably put them back once the problem has been resolved but if you have updated and you want to roll back i'll show you how to do it so if you've updated by clicking on the windows update button or it's automatically updated and put those files on the system and you're still having issues then you will need to remove these so you will need to uninstall this uh, update and i'll show you how to do that in a second if you have rolled out the update and you're having issues with it now it's affected quite a few different uh, makes and brands of printers there has been an article on reddit and there has been a publication on uh, bleeping computers website about the issue as well and put links to certain printers and manufacturers that are having issues uh, with this so let me go ahead and uh, I'll show you basically how to remove it from the computer. We're going to go down to the search box here and you're going to need to basically put in here CMD and run this as administrator. Once the command prompt box window opens up, you're going to put in this command here. And this will remove the two offending uh, files which are causing the problem. And of course it will leave the rest of the update in situ. But Basically, you can see here mine is saying that it's not installed, and that's because I've not run uh, the updated files on this system, uh, on this main system here. But if you have, then these files will then just uninstall when you run this command. So both of mine are not on the system, so it's not causing me any sort of concern. But if it is causing you concern and you are having issues and blue screens, then this is the culprit, and you need to uh, follow this procedure to remove them until Microsoft actually uh, roll out updates with these fixes for these files so let's go into programs and features here you can see here up here view installed files you can see this is where you're going to see all of the updates here and they will be listed here as well so if you've got them on the system you can uninstall them and they will be listed with this code here kb 5808 and also kb 5802 those are the two culprits Anyway, I think that's just going to be about it for this video. Just a really quick video just to show you basically how to resolve or work around uh, an issue which is due to the latest Patch Tuesday update on March. I tend to hold off on security updates for at least five days. That way, if there's any sort of problems, Microsoft generally pull them and I don't end up with a load of hassle. Anyway, my name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a big special thanks to all my YouTube members who have joined my YouTube members group. Have a lovely weekend, guys, and I shall see you again for another video real soon. Thanks again for watching. Bye for now.